Hello everybody, it's Ladle. And yeah, now we will continue our draft we started. And yeah, it doesn't look so good until now. Until now we got two losses and one win. But yeah, let's get right into our next match. And we'll see how this one turns out. With we did some adjustments to our deck and won one match with it. Um, yeah, maybe we can perform a bit better now. We'll see. Okay, so I go first and here we have the same pro uh, problem we had already. I mean, it's actually a good hand, but I'm lacking white mana, so I definitely have to take a mulligan. This one looks even better. This looks very, very good here. Definitely going to keep this. Um, I don't know if it's the right play. I'm thinking about removing the Leonian of the Lost Pride or the Annex. I think it will be the... Yeah. We'll see. I just hope to get a lot of early aggression with my Hero of the Pride. Yeah, let's see, you'll see white mana source and because depending on what he plays next, I can follow up with the annex. Okay, he draws. Yeah, that's definitely going to be the annex and buffing up our hero of the pride and going for free damage. I think he has a removal spell, he's just thinking about what he wants to remove. If he removes my hero, I'll be in a lot of trouble. Okay. As well, we do this. That's fine, okay. So now we have a 6-3 Trample, and furthermore, it's also enchanted, so my Kametra's uh, Blessing give it Hex Proof. So I really hope that he doesn't have any removal and I can use the Kametra's Blessing next turn to give him a very strong blow. That's fine. So here's the problem. Ah, oh, and it gains indestructible. Okay, that's very good. I don't want to play a land for this turn, so I can use the Thrill of Possibility um, to discard a land and draw a card. But I think I'll be starting with an attack. Then he'll probably block like... Oh, he'll double block. That's even better. Oh no, go back to the double block, please. Yeah, that's awesome. So now we can... And now it has indestructible, hexproof, trample, vigilance, which is just big. And I think about... Yeah. Yeah, I'll be not playing the land for the turn. So if I find another thrill of possibility, I'll have the, the chance to remove stuff. But the problem now is if he plays a strong creature, my hero of the pride will have to fight it. Okay, that's good. 
We removed a creature with lifelink, okay. I mean, it could be worse. Oh no, that's very good. Okay, so I play a land for this turn and a trickster. Yeah, I think I should really pressure this guy. Oh. Oh, I totally forgot. Yeah, nice. We got another win out of this. Okay, let's get right into the next match. That was a good one. Okay, this hand looks pretty good. It's a bit slow, but I have the perfect mana source to follow up on all of my creatures. And I have some removal, at least an artifact removal. So we'll give it a try. Okay, that's fine. I don't think it was the right order to play my lands. I hope that he invests a lot of his mana into using his Devourer of Memory. Um, because I have a way more aggressive deck than he does. Okay. Yeah, I'll follow up with a trickster. He didn't play a land last turn. But now he's able to. Uh, I hope to find an instant or something like that. That would have been awesome, so I could have used the, the hero of the next spawn. Yeah, I'll use my trickster. Maybe he'll block. Okay, he takes it. That's fine. I really hope to find some instance. That's good. That's very good. Oh no, let's attack first. He should have blocked there. He really has mana problems. Yeah, I thought so too. He didn't draw another land. Yeah, I understand this guy. It can be very frustrating if you're not drawing lands. Okay, we got to our third win. Let's go for maybe the fourth, but <laughs> we'll see.
Okay. Oh, we have a silver ranked player. Now. Okay, he goes first. I honestly think that this hand isn't too bad because I be drawing. I have a lot of lands. I have a nice free drop. Yeah, let's give it a try. Come on. And of course, I'm drawing another land. Okay, you might have a mirror match up here. I hope that he attacks and buffs up his oracle. And sadly, he didn't. Ah, <laughs> look what we got here. Yeah, let's hide our red mana. And see what he does against this. I hope that he doesn't have another mana so that he is able to use these Iros Blessing and kill my Tyrannica. Oh, he also runs black. Now it's becoming interesting. Yeah, he'll attack with the Oracle and hope that I block, but then he'll pump us up, so I'll not block. And now he'll play another big creature, will he? Oh, that's not good at all. A hero of the pride, okay. Was this the right play? I really need to save up my Tyrannica effect into another attack of mine. He'll definitely come up with a very strong attack now due to the Hero of Pride. Okay, what was that? Sacrifice a creature. And at the beginning of my upkeep, oh no. Yeah, of course he passes the turn. Who will I sacrifice? The thing is, I have to sacrifice the Tyrannica. Sadly, I have to do this. And now I'm drawing lands again. I, I'm really not happy about this. Sadly, the Sentinel's Eyes aren't a flash enchantment. I think I'll again have to pass the turn and sit this one out. Yeah, the enchantment he used was very bad for me. I could have sacrificed the token, but then I would have kept the the enchantment even longer, and I don't have the creatures to, to hold this, or I cannot create enough tokens. It's very sad because I didn't get anything from my Tyrannica. I should have been aggress way more aggressive with it. Now 
Yeah, he's reading Zero of the Pride. Will he attack? It might be interesting to block this with the hero of the next bomb. Yeah. Of course I'm drawing another land. I think I need to be way more aggressive. I'll buff up my token and start attacking him now because he has to double block my trickster. Oh, he would have to double block it. I hope to... Yeah, to pretend that he thinks that I have a lot of good cards in hand even though it all are just lands. Sadly, I can't use it escape. Should I do this? I think I should. Yeah, let's go. Let's give it a try. Could have been worse. Oh, of course. That's very bad. Omen of Fort, sure. The thing is, I have a few lands in play and a lot in my hands. I really hope to find more creatures now. Okay, I honestly have to say, if I can remove the hero of the pride, I'll definitely do it. Because, yes, I have the escape ability from Sentinel's Eyes. And if I find something now, it can be very helpful. Oh god, okay. Oh no, no, oh no, this again. And of course I find a sage or a saga. Oh, he got me with that. That's so bad. Even if I find creatures now, he'll immediately kill them. And of course, I find a plane. Yeah, I have to play this. Even though I don't find any target for it now, I hope to find a few in the next steps and then be able to follow up with those. I don't want him to find any target. Okay, it's still until end of my turn, so it's okay, but yeah. He'll be coming for another 5 damage at least. He'll remove one of my creatures. Oh god. Okay. Uh, 
I think that's it. Yeah. Well. I should have en I should have enchanted it. Now he'll be hitting me for another five damage here. Yeah, it doesn't look very good. Yeah, sadly, I drew so many lands. <clears throat> yeah, sadly. I think he could have sacrificed his omen way earlier. Oh, use it like this, okay. Yeah, nice game. Sadly, we draw, or oh, we drew so many lands. But still, it, this draft turned out better than it began because, yeah, we got two more wins. Um, so, yeah, it's still, it's okay. We might get a bonus pack here. Oh, sadly not. But 300 gems. Let's open this pack. Okay. Oh, nice. Interesting card. Another wild card. Oh. Oh, that's very interesting. I think I'll be adding this card to my Ashiok deck. Here, yeah, let's quickly do this. Yeah. Because some Scrylands, why not? Yeah, this looks good. That's a helpful card. I should rename this deck. Okay. Okay, guys, we finished our first draft with three to three, uh, better than ex better than I expected when we started this draft. I'll be doing way more drafts, so stay tuned for this. I really like the set of Feroz Beyond Death, and yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Bye.